Mini Varsity Cheerleaders. Hometown Hoop starts right now. All right, now this is the first edition of Hometown Hoops here in 2013. Welcome to all of you folks at home watching. I'm Earl Arms. And I'm Jamie Edmonds. The basketball season in full swing. Few teams are still unbeaten. Hamity Hawks are one of them hosting Atherton tonight. Hamity is 4-0 hosting Atherton in this GAC Blue matchup. Let's go to the first quarter. Hawks jump ahead because of Sultan Brewster. Cool name. The three putting Hamity up by three. Wolverines, though, they would have the answer. Devon Stadfelt through the lane and gets the floater to drop. Atherton down just one. But then the Hawks, they begin to run around the perimeter to DeMar Ford, the junior with the shot, plus the foul right there. Then more Hamity. This time it would be off the rebound. It's Donta Gordon deep. Let's get to him first. Down the field, Donta Gordon, there he is, to Eric Layton. Two of his game-high 18 points. Hamity undefeated and unscathed tonight. They win 77-41. The Hawks now 5-0. All right, now Flint Northern hosting Powers and new head coach Jeremy Trent in the Saginaw Valley League matchup. Vikings up in the second quarter. Amari Yates, Ivory inside, doesn't get the first one to drop, but the second plus the foul. Vikings up six. Nick Sullivan of Gridiron fame. We remember him from I remember Friday him. Night Football. He gets the friendly bounce there. Powers down four. Then the Vikings, they turn it on for just a bit. Ivory once again. This time from beyond the arc, three of his game high, 27 points Ooh. on the night. Then they go up double digits off the steal by Ivory. He then finds Carlos Boone, the senior, stops, pops, consecutive threes by Northern Vikings. They roll on the charges for their fourth win, 67-36. All right, packed house to see one of the best rivalries in the area, the Hill versus the High, Ooh. never disappoints. Mm -hmm. We all know that first corner off defensive rebound. Elijah won. Daniels gets it to go down. Jalen Adams for the easy layup tied at two. Lumberjacks again. Eric Davis dishes to Demetrius Humes down low. He finishes. Here comes Saginaw. Aljavon Eichelberger for the slam. That one's just pretty. <laughs> Quarter winding down. Saginaw gets own rebound. Let's check out some hand-eye coordination right there. Jerry Smith sees a lane. Trojans lead after one, but Arthur Hill turns it on late, outscoring Saginaw in the next three quarters, including 15 points in the fourth. In fact, they outscored them 22 of the last 25 points. The game, the Lumberjacks win it 75-54. They get the first part of that battle. More scores for you. Bindle staying perfect. The Tigers beating up on New Lothrop 71-54. Beecher, the defending state champs in Class C, also without a loss. They go, on, go down to Otis Lake, the Lakeville and hand them an 85-46 loss. Then Mount Pleasant taking on Heritage as the Oilers win 58-51.